and so th this these are the uh, transfer characteristics for a, a half wave rectifier now we'll see uh, some examples on half wave rectifier a half wave rectifier having a resistive load of 1 kilo ohm rectifies an ac voltage of 325 volt peak peak value and the diode has forward resistance of 100 ohms the rms value of output current and output voltage and efficiency are we want to calculate this all this value suppose this is a rectifier circuit load resistance is given of uh, register load of 1 kilo ohm diode has forward resistance of 100 ohms rf equal to 100 ohms and there is an input voltage which have a 325 volt peak value means vm equal to 325 volts vm equal to 325 volts now in this circuit we want to calculate the output current uh, rms value of output current and rms value of output voltage first remember one thing that whenever there is a problem on a rectifier circuit don't try to solve uh, don't try to do calculation in terms of voltage because we have already seen in the uh, efficiency that uh, the voltage maximum value of the voltage at the output and input both are different but the maximum value of current in the circuit at any point will be same so always we will do the calculation in terms of current <coughs> first we know that the maximum voltage vm is equal to 325 volts the diode resistance and the load resistance are given now in this circuit the maximum current can be calculated by dividing the maximum voltage by the total resistance of the circuit that is rf plus rl so it will be 325 divided by 100 plus 1000 will be zero point two nine five amperes so this is the uh, maximum value of current in the circuit now the rms value of the current i rms RMS value of the current can be calculated, but before that we should know the waveform of the current current. The current will flow only for half cycle. So the waveform of the current will be like this. So RMS will be RMS value will be I M by 2 and it will be 0.295 divided by 2. will be uh, 0.1477 amperes or 147.7 milliamperes <coughs> now the rms value of output current output voltage will be rms value of current into load resistance rl will be
147.7 volts now the efficiency will be output dc power by input ac power into 100% output dc power will be equal to idc square into rl and input ac power will be equal to i rms square into rf plus rl because rs is zero <coughs> there is no winding in the circuit now efficiency will be equal to idc square into rl divided by i rms square into rf plus rl will be equal to i m by pi whole square into rl divided by i m by 2 whole square into rf plus rl this will be cancelled 4 by pi square into rl 1k divided by 100 plus 1000 or 1k so this will be 1000 upon uh, 1000 plus 100 4 by pi square into 100 percent will be equal to 36.8 percent so only 36.8 percent power of the input is obtained at the output